Hey everybody, Peaky Hill Gamer here. I'm continuing on recording some videos today and catching up and saw this on Polygon. This is really cool. Starting today, anyone can turn their Xbox One into a dev kit for free. It's not 100% free. And let me read some of this. Um, converting a console to dev mode requires no special equipment fees, though a full, to fully access the abilities, users need to create a dev center account for 19 bucks. It's not much. Um, Look at that right now. It's a it's in preview mode. The preview mode offers only access to 448 megabytes of the eight gigs around, and dev mode comes out of preview access for one gigabytes of memory. Now these are for development developing for universal Windows program development. This is not making a full Xbox One game. You need to get a, a dev kit for it. But for games that come from the mobile over, or you want to have some small apps, I mean that work on it anybody can do do this and it's pretty awesome um first uh, first user has to download the dev mode activation app from the xbox game store launching the app kicks off a welcome screen and a link to documentation the details of what's expected when you switch over from your retail to a dev kit requirements join the windows insider program pcs running windows 10 wired connect wired connection from pc to xbox one i can see that Install the latest Visual Studio 2015 and Windows builds. Have at least 30 gigs of storage free on your console. And you know, this is really good. It's not, it's not for, it's not to be, I can go down there and turn on my Xbox One to a dev kit and go make a AAA game. No, but Universal Windows platform, let me see if I got that right. <laughs> There's so many acronyms running today, you know, Universal Windows Program. Ah, too many acronyms now. This is going to allow people that take phone apps, small apps from Windows, just pull them back and forth. And look, some games may not even need more than a gig of memory. And I think they'll open that up over time. But this is a step toward Microsoft making the Xbox just another type of PC in their UW, UWP plat, you know, type of, I don't know, it's a platform. And this is going to be how they're going to turn the Xbox into really not a console, but a different style of PC in the living room, much more simple. But this is really cool. And for Microsoft, like I said, they've been, been hearing about this for three years. And it's just about three years. Um, this is cool. Now, if you want a real dev kit, you need to buy a dev kit and you need to make, you know, but if you're going to be buying a dev kit, you're going to be a triple A developer or at least have a team where you you know you have tens of thousands of dollars maybe a hundred thousand or something and get started in making a real xbox one game but if you got a neat little game that is indie development and you don't need a lot of a lot of horsepower you got xbox one do this with other a few other steps but a couple things you got a dev kit this is powerful and this is going to make indie developers love the xbox one even more and it's moving toward that state where windows just pretty much it windows and microsoft just becomes merges the pc and the xbox the xbox is another type of pc so i think this is really cool i want to know what you think let me know in the comments below subscribe to me here on youtube follow me on facebook twitch twitter uh, skirmishfiles.com for everything retro and also crosshairtv.com all right everybody pko gamer out